This is awesome! Wow. Awesome. Airships have long been a mainstay in Final Fantasy lore, offering various bands of plucky heroes a chance to get off the ground and explore the world more quickly, as well as provide passage to areas inaccessible by foot or chocobo. Final Fantasy XV has an airship too, but the way it works and how you get it is unlike any other game in the series. First off, you need to beat the game. There's no other way around it. Once you've seen the credits, you'll be able to save your clear data, which will let you hop back in and travel back in time to Lucis, where a whole bunch of new side quests just unlocked for you, including the one you need to transform your regalia into the Type F. What you're looking for is a quest called Form with Garrison. If it doesn't show up in your list of quests, you may need to camp for a night, so it'll show up. It's in the northern section of Lead. Simply head there, follow the quest markers, and steal yourself for a very difficult fight. The quest has a level requirement of 46, but the boss that shows up at the end of several waves of mechs and troopers is a real toughie. Once they're all finished, you'll earn a strange engine, the third part that you need to fix up the regalia. Where are the other two, you ask? Well, you already have them. By completing chapters 5 and 6, you should already have the other two parts that you need. Simply head over to Cindy at Hammerhead, hand over the parts, and you are now the proud owner of the Regalia Type F, a magnificent vehicle capable of driving over long distances with an infinite fuel tank, as well as the ability to fly pretty much anywhere in Lucis. There's a catch though. Flying is easy, landing not so much. You need to slow down and land over a straight stretch of road, otherwise you'll crash and burn hard, forcing you to reload your last save. It can be really tricky too, especially when you're looking for the secret dungeon accessible only by the Type F. To get here, you need to fly to the east to the Ravito Volcano. See that little orange line to the north of the little loop on your map? That's not a mistake, it's actually a tiny landing strip hidden in the dirt. You might uh, crash a few times, but if you land here and head up to the northeast, you'll find a dungeon that only opens up at night. Inside here is a massive, hours-long secret chamber filled with platforming challenges and puzzles that I still haven't figured out how to finish yet. Now that should be more than enough to set you on a path to absorbing the wealth of post-game content Final Fantasy XV has to offer. And if you're looking for more great videos like this, including our video review of Final Fantasy XV, be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel. And if you want to check out our written review, head on over to GamesRadar.com.